Job chapter 20 and 27. The heavens shall reveal his iniquity and the earth shall rise up against him. Kala Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai. Giving our praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai by Hashem Harakakwadash. Give double honors to all the elders and the apostles of Great Milsom for teaching us this truth. Sanitation to all the sincere Akim and rise up to the house of David. So this is from Fox News. Four people sent to hospital after family dog attacks owners and friends. Fox News 11, Los Angeles. Without further ado. Four people are in the hospital this afternoon after they were viciously attacked by a pit bull. Yeah, one of the victims was the dog's owner. Animal control officers were called to an area of the Santa Ana River where there was an illegal encampment. They say the three-year-old pit bull attacked the owner inside her RV, also attacked two friends with her. They say a fourth person was bitten when he tried to rescue one of the victims in the RV. The pit bull will be euthanized. Officers say the dog had just given birth to a litter of puppies, which may have provoked the attack. Also attacked two friends. So they're gonna, they're gonna, you said they're gonna euthanize the dog. The dog went into his spirit. You know, the dogs, the animals are fed up with e with UEs as well. You know, the whole earth is rising up against you. Job chapter twenty, let's, let's go up to twenty six. And all darkness shall be hid in his sacred place. A fire not blown shall consume him. It shall. Go ill with him that that is left in his tabernacle. The heavens shall reveal his iniquity and the earth shall rise up against him. <laughs> in this case, it was a dog. The, the, the spirit created for vengeance jumped on the dog. An angel, a demon jumped on the dog and it turned against his owner. And for people that was trying to stop it from biting up his owner, the, um, it turned on them too. So he doesn't like the ease, they're fed up with it. The dogs, the animals are rising up against the ease. So-called white people, the earth, the fires over there in the Mediterranean. You know, it's too many places to mention. You've got um, Greece, Turkey, California, Algeria, Canada, Siberia. Boy, there's a lot of fires, man. You know, not, it's not, there's so much going on, they can't put it all on mainstream news. Uh, you got the Louisiana floods. People are homeless, man. People are in darkness. Over a million people in darkness. No electricity. So, the heaven shall reveal his iniquity and the earth shall rise up against him. The increase of his house shall depart and his good shall flow away. That's why you see them homeless, man, walking the streets. A lot of them, me, so-called white people, walking on the streets, talking to themselves with their rucksacks. You know what I mean? And some of them have got these tents, you know, this is this is worldwide. This is I'm pretty sure in most of you in your local area see a lot of that taking place wherever you are in the world. You're seeing this because this is all prophecy. Surgical strikes, judgments. The increase of his house shall depart and his good shall flow away in the day of his wrath. All the things that he stole. You're going to end up giving it back and you're going to compensate. <laughs> Not only are you going to give back the things you stole, because gold and silver and certain precious stones are just transferred. You can't keep them. They don't, um, they, they don't dissolve. Like the things you have in your houses when, you, when it was burnt down. The gold and silver is there. It's just waiting for, the, you know, when we come back in, um, when we come back with our new bodies, we're going to collect everything. It's not going to be dissolved. It's not going to weigh. And, and not to mention what you got in the vaults. Yeah, over here in the in the, um in the bank of Bank of England and wherever else you're hiding your gold and silver, our gold and silver and other precious metals and elements and stones, wherever else you're hiding it, we're gonna have the we're gonna know where to find it. Cause we're gonna have inbuilt nav navigation radar to find anything, <laughs> everything. So like I say, you're gonna you're gonna repay back. Everything you stole and you're going to compensate. And don't fool yourself for one minute. You're dealing with spiritual beings. So this is the portion of the wicked man from God, from Yahweh, and the heritage appointed unto him by Yahweh. This is your future. Judgments. The whole earth is rising up against you. Let's hit another precept to make the point. Because you may be saying, why, why is so much things happening right now to earth? And we're hearing, we're hearing stories like this. 
This psalm looks like Armageddon. People are saying, looks, this looks like the apocalypse concerning the fires when they're seeing that. And a lot of them are walking around. They lost everything. Their farmland, their, their agriculture, their livelihood. You know, one woman was actually telling the story that she lost everything she had. Her livelihood, her ranch, the clothes, the only thing she had was the clothes on her back. So this is why in Baruch chapters 4 and 31 says, Miserable are they that afflicted thee and rejoice at thy fall. Yeah, you put us in slavery, the so-called black people themselves, what you, you like to call black people that you love to hate. Miserable, and it goes on to say, Miserable are the cities which thy children served. Miserable is she that received thy sons. For as she rejoiced at the ruin and was glad at thy fall, you was glad. And he gave us all those bywords. Coloured people, black people. You know, we're none of those things. You know, the N-words. We're none of those things. We're children of God. Yeah? And your, and your elite know who we are. And you've been hiding it for centuries, for decades. You, you never wanted this to get out. For as she rejoiced at thy ruin and was glad at thy fall, so shall she be grieved for her own desolation. Right, so you know that this is the answer. Why your houses, you're losing your homes. With, by, by means of water, flooding, flash flooding. By means of fire. By means of the animals rising up against you. By means of the pollution. You know, because these are the snares that you trap for us. And it's falling upon your own head. For I will take away, you know, re regarding the chemtrails, the pollution... And uh, the class A drugs too, the fentanyl, the opium, it's all falling upon your own head. That's why you're dying by the, you're starting to, your deaths now are starting to increase. Your dead bodies are starting to increase. But we know, because we, we are spiritual people and we can see what is going on. It's all prophecy. For I will take away the rejoicing of her great multitude, and her pride shall be turned unto mourning. Right. This is, for, this is the reason for what you've done to the so-called black people and still doing, having us in your possession. And that is a sin according to the Levit Leviticus law. Right? So you're going to have to pay back what you stole and compensate. For fire shall come upon her from the everlasting long to endure and she shall be inhabited of devils for a great time. You're going to be inhabited with devils for a great time. So... This is the portion of the wicked man from God and the appointed and the heritage of the appointed unto him by God. This is your future. We've got one more precept to end it off. Yeah, we don't need to beat a dead horse. Although sometimes we may, you know, because what you've done to the animals, that's why the animals are rising up against you. Your own animals are attacking you, man. As a matter of fact, let me go to that one. Uh... Sarah 39 and 28 says, There be spirits that are created for vengeance, which in their fury lay on sour strokes in the time of destruction. They pour out their force and appease the wrath of him that made them. Right. Most I made animals. He made them to be looked after. But you wicked people, you treat them horribly and they and they get and they got and they're spiritual. So they turn against you, man, and they bite up the, the owners and they bite up all the people that try to stop them from biting them up because their spirit's created for vengeance and they're turning on their owners. And there's a lot more that, that goes on than what is mentioned in the news. And that's going to increase too because the earth is rising up against you, wicked. You so-called white people, they don't like you. The earth doesn't like you. They want you off the planet. 29. Fire and hell. That's why we're seeing all these fires in the Mediterranean. Greece, Turkey. And all these other places, um, Cyprus, um, uh, Algeria, Canada, and like I say, the list goes on. Siberia, fires and hell and famine. Oh, don't not to mention what happened over there in um, was it Germany? The the flash flood. Yeah, the the European countries rather. Europe, the you know, um, Louisiana. Man, is too much. Death, famine, death. All these things were created for vengeance. Teeth of wild beasts, scorpions, serpents, and the sword punishing the wicked to destruction. This is the punishment that is coming upon you. 
whatsoever a man soweth, that he should also reap, what goes around comes around. There's a last precept to end it off. Point is made, we've we've killed it, we've crushed it. Psalms 35 and 8 says, Let destruction come upon him at unawares. Right, you hear that? When he least expect it. And let his net that he hath hid catch himself. Unto that very destruction, let him fall. Right. So it's going to hit you when you least expect it. The, the net that you have hid is going to catch you. That very destruction is going to fall upon you. What you've set, the snare, you want to fall into your own snare. Yeah. More Can't put it more plain and straight than that. Whatsoever a man soweth, that he shall also reap. So your animals are turning against you. Buying up your own animals. The animals are... Vex, just as angry as, um, you know, because really they're spiritual, you see? And the most I put a spirit on them. And they know who the wicked are. So I want to give all praises to your heart. But Hashem, your shaf, give me the spirit to do this video. Yes, the house of David is rising. And everything the wicked have done to us, past, present and future, is falling upon their own head.